Hola, uh, me llamo es Malcolm Ian Cross de Slam City. Uh, saludos para Bisarma TV. En esos programas hacíamos la conversión, digámoslo así, de, de gráficos, de Spectrum, sobre todo, hacia, hacia los demás. Hacer un videojuego tiene una labor inicial de creativa, ¿eh? donde la idea es fundamental. Yo soy, yo era músico, pero a mí siempre me ha gustado mucho dibujar, ¿no? Eh, date cuenta que yo me he criado con los TVOs prácticamente de los kioscos. Eh, a, a mí como me gusta mucho el cine y una vez oigo podcast de, de videojuegos y oigo un montón de cine, y creo que 500 pesetas, dos días, tres euros, un par de días, o tres. Eh, ento entonces... Nos encontramos ante el Trinity College. Aquí tenéis una carrilleta. Aquí la placa marca como 1020 metros de altura ya. Pues es el baloncesto, bienvenidos al espectáculo. Y como diría el mítico Andrés Montes, bienvenidos al club. No, aquí está currado todo al milímetro, al más puro estilo. Es la segunda parte de Outrun. Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of the FA Cup semi-final. Today it's Arsenal against York City. Let's get straight to Wembley Stadium then. The arch looking absolutely at its best on a beautiful clear day. Here's your comedy team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. So this is it, semi-final day in the FA Cup. Well, nobody remembers the losers, and uh, I've been on the end of losing situations, and you just do not want it. It's one of those days to forget, but a day to remember if you get through. York City, I think they're a good side, you know. They played very well in that away victory against Notts County. Maybe a little misleading, that 3-0 victory. And uh, I don't think they're going to follow it up. I think they, they will lose here today. This is the Arsenal lineup. Wojciech Szczesny starts in goal. Kieran Gibbs starts with Maciej Debushi in the fullback positions. Theo Walcott starts with Santa Cazorla on the flanks. Seydou Dumbia is the lone striker. This is the starting lineup today. the referee so hard to get to this FA Cup semi-final. Now all that preparation is going to be uh, tested as the action starts. Yeah, I can't wait for this one because two teams that have been in great form, uh, you just hope they can reproduce that now when it matters. Summerfield. Well, that's widened the game here and they've got it to the wide man well. They're on the move now. has gone out of play with the deflection and it's out for a corner not sure it was your forte the slide tackle but what about this one well it's this lad's forte because he really does nick the ball away cleanly and here's the header and the header was at the goalkeeper and a straightforward save. I think the people would have thought he'd been busier with that, but instead straight in his arms. Thomas Rosetsky. This is a game I know he wants to play in the man that you would call the main creative genius, if you like, for the home team. He's suspended. Yeah, and at home when they've got to be. Very nearly a goal. It's hit the bar and it's back in play. He'll never be afraid to shoot, but he'll be hoping for better efforts than that. Alan, your view on the attempt at goal? Well, nothing wrong with a strike, but 
It was always rising, no surprise in the end to see if he hit the bar. Keeper makes the save and it's a clean save too. Doesn't drop the ball. Summerfield. And the ball's got away from him. Here's Walcott. Mesut Ozil. Here comes the challenge. Walcott could get his cross in now. Oh, in goes the cross. Dealt with by the defender, the cross. Here's the chance. Jack Wilshire. Now he's lost the ball. Summerfield. Arsenal looking for what should be a routine victory. Well, it's a quick break. Got to be. And he's done it. we're getting from a side that really was expected to get beaten here today they're determined not to and they've scored yeah it's one of those martin where every single player i think has, has got an eight out of ten at least and it's just all clicked out here today from the scoring here, 1-0. Mesut Ozil. Zedou Gumbia. Past his man. In with the chance. Here's the shot, and it's just wide of the target. Be a throw. Matteo Debushi. We could be in. Here's the chance. Still in play here. By Arsenal standards, this has been pretty awful uh, to this point, but of course they have the capacity to turn games around and they'll need... Here he is with the chance, got to be, great goalkeeping. And now they've got a corner on the attack again, the team that's leading by one goal.
quality, no doubt about it. Well, the ball's fallen to him there. It's just like a video game, isn't it? The way hits landed at his feet. It's a goal worth looking at again, isn't it? Two shots, none on target for Arsenal. Well, they've been almost non-existent here in front of goal, and I think that's affected the confidence of the strikers, just really can't hit the target. Ramsey. Theo Walcott. Here's the chance to get in the cross. Mark Hornship. A glorious first half in this semi-final. Just got to settle down and see it through in the second half to be in the final itself. Yeah, I think it's a formality for this side. They're far superior to their opponents today. But what we've got here is a difficult situation for the home manager. The away team, probably the better side, and they now lead with that goal just before the interval by two. Well, it's no fluke, Martin. Great anticipation here as we get ready for the second half. It's where you want to try and get control in midfield, and they've got the ball. given by the opposition. Theo Walcott. Comes in with a tackle. Summerfield. Well, we might get an update on that injury now from our man Jeff Shreves. Jeff. It's going to take a while to see how bad this injury is because he got trodden on in that last challenge. So his foot is definitely a bit sore. As always, Jeff does know what's going on, and thanks for that, Jeff. Mesut Ozil. Summerfield. short of time now well, it's not going to be a complicated approach now long balls into the box from any angle it's all about trying to win that first header Debussy Santi Cazola chance for the cross Crosses reach his teammate, Gubia! It's missed, the chance. Can be a match winner, this lad, but today, no. And it was one of his lesser performances. I think it's a bit hard on him. The supporters seem to be happy to see him coming off. Yeah, that's the life of a winger sometimes. You are dependent on your service and... 
obviously dependent on what you do with the ball and he's not been clever enough in possession today Good link up. Got to be. Well, kept the shot out, but still in play. Pick his spot now. He's goal! With a brilliant header. about this goal from your old club it's a beauty from start to finish it was class now the keeper quite rightly is disgusted with his defenders because they've just not helped him out there and here is another angle on that goal in the midfield area. Well, it doesn't matter how you win a semi-final, it's just Ladies that and you win, and they have this great result. All of them getting over the line. Nobody remembers losing semi-finalists, but they are the winners. So it's full time, and the final score, 2-1. I'll leave you with the full match highlights, and until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling.